I'm meteorologist Tim Armstrong at the National Weather Service in Wilmington, and this is your climate outlook for the 2024 and 25 winter season. Despite localized heavy rain from potential tropical cyclone 8 and from Hurricane Helene earlier this fall, persistent high pressure through October and into the first half of November means our 60-day rainfall totals are only 20 to 30 percent of normal along the coast. Outlooks from the Climate Prediction Center suggest we'll see increased chances for below normal rainfall this winter, which could lead to further expansion of drought conditions across the Carolinas. A climate pattern called La Nina is expected to develop this winter. La Nina is a natural cooling of tropical East Pacific Ocean water that creates changes in wind circulation around the planet. Across the Carolinas, La Nina typically brings a reduction in rainfall during the winter season. Climate forecasters believe this will be a weak and short-lived La Nina, which means its effects may be minor. La Nina doesn't have a substantial impact on our winter temperatures. However, Climate Prediction Center forecasters do show an increased potential for above normal temperatures this winter, mainly due to ongoing climate change. Observed winter temperatures have increased by 1 to 2 degrees over the past 50 years. It's been 35 years since Wilmington or Myrtle Beach have seen 5 inches or more in a snowstorm. Even inland in Florence, South Carolina, it's been 24 years since the last major snowstorm. I wouldn't get my hopes up too much this winter. An overwhelming majority of the last 22 La Nina winters had below normal snowfall totals across the coastal southeast. It only takes one storm to make a winter, but even that might be asking a lot for this year. We've got plenty more details about this winter's climate outlook available on our webpage. Go to weather.gov ILM for more details.